Hey guys, what's up? The Blaze here with the next episode of Cain and Labor I don't know why, but somehow I forgot last time to show you guys a preview of the wall materials that I could use, so I'm going to remember this video, I promise that. Um, yeah, so this time I shall remember it, just comment with the for one you guys like the most, and I'll definitely build a wall out of whatever you guys, whatever you guys prefer. So let's see, what do I want to do today? Um, we've got that thing still. I don't really know exactly what I plan on making all the, um, other things out of it. I can't remember what I decided on, if I decided on anything that is. Let's see, so I got a lot of wool. I got a lot of wood. Got a bit of sandstone, some jungle wood. I definitely want something colorful for the, um, the new thing on my barbers. Let's see, I got a lot of Oh wait, that's right. I think I was deciding on stone brick. Wood farms, maybe? I don't know. Oh well. I guess that's what all this cobblestone's for, is to smell. I mean, I can't imagine that I would have decided on smelt or making it out of cobblestone regularly, because that's kind of boring. I mean, just making a whole bunch of things out of that. Too much brown. Let's see, let's put more cobblestone in there. Take the gold out. Get that iron. So we got minor goods, we got a bit of gold, we got a bit of iron. There we go, we stacked it up. What else is in there? Seems like the coal was misaligned for a moment. Okay, so we're good with that. Um, let's see, what do I want to build first? Which type of farm? Um, I probably should move my cows pretty soon. Maybe, wait, what's that sign say? Barracks. Okay, so this is going to be my barracks area. Like the armory sort of thing where I'm going to put all my weapons and stuff like that. Maybe a few snow golems. Maybe even iron golem if I get enough iron. So let's see, this is going to be my indoor farm for all the produce. And then I guess maybe over here could be my um, animal farm. Like right around here probably would be a good idea. And so first I think I'll probably just build get building this one because if I build the um, produce farm first I can move this farm, get rid of that, that'll make more room for other things too. So let's see, got six stone, seven, yeah, let's see. Yeah, I guess that's what I was planning on building. Another. Don't have any stone bricks in there, maybe I have some upstairs, I'll have to go check on that. Let's go do that real quickly. Then I'll figure out how I plan on making each of these farms. Because, I mean, I've got the wheat farm already automated and everything, so I don't really need any other wheat in that farm. I guess I'll make just, like, a special other farm. Maybe I'll make another floor for that, actually. Oh, wait, that's right. It's supposed to be in here. Pretty sure it's just... Yep, there we go. See, I think the stonebrook's actually look pretty cool for it, so let's see. We'll just use that. Okay, sweet. Now let's go figure out the dimensions for it. I'll make a door, or possibly I already have one. Um, yeah, got a door. So let's go figure it out. Let's see, so what do I want to do with this? We got a nice little slope, but do I want to actually use that slope, or should I just make it flat? Um, hmm. Don't really know which one to do. Let's just level it up bit, I guess. I definitely want to make it indoor so because I don't have to get blown up or anything. So, let's see, how am I going to do this? Hmm, perhaps I can make like a giant, um... Let's see, let's get my circle chart out. Okay, so let's see, if I were to make it four blocks on the inside, let's see, that would be... 11 blocks. So basically I just use the igloo pattern that I have and that's how I should make it. So I could make like just a giant um, sort of like cylinder shape. That would be pretty cool. I guess like a giant tower. Or just make a giant square of some sort. Yeah, why don't we just do a square. Let's just level this all out. Um, yeah, this is a pretty big area right here, so there's no chance I'm going to level it all out. Uh, maybe just like up here. And I'll just make it like a staircase going down. That should be good.
which are perhaps I can make like two separate buildings for each one. Like I could do like the carrot farm and stuff as a giant cylinder, and then it's got like a bridge on the outside taking you to the um, other part, which could be the melon and pumpkin farm, and that could be more square shape. And then of course the pumpkin farm, but also the sugar cane farm built in on a different floor. So yeah, I'll probably do it, something like that. Okay, so let's see. Where do we want to put each part? Okay, we'll need another door so we can have connection for both things. Okay, let's put that. Let's grab some oak wood, because I guess we can use that plank version of it for the actual building. Nope, almost night time to sleep or quickly don't want to get killed. We don't want a repeat of yesterday actually. Or technically last week, yeah, last week. Let's just get through that drawer. Let's get close the drawer with my circle thing on it. Oh crap, I'm the volume I turned down on my headset, let's just fix that. Okay, that's good. So let's see, we're back over here. We got a large indoor farm. Okay, so what I think I'll do is I'll make like over here could be the um, circle part. So let's say we build it right here. Two, 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 one, two, three, four, five. Two, one, two, three, four, five. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, one, two. There we go. So now if we just build it up a couple more blocks tall. Wait a minute, that's right. I still need another block for the, um, a couple blocks for the walk around area because I don't want to just make it entirely farmland. So I'll destroy this. And maybe a two block walk around, so instead of going 11, I'll want to go um, 15, I guess. Should be good. Okay, there we go. So let's get the block drawer down with the circle guide. So let's see, what we got. Um, so we have to do three, four, five. Then one, two, one, one, two, two, three, four, five. One, two, one. Drat. Okay, let's try this again. Let's bring up a couple more blocks than that. this so one two three four five two one and two look up I 
shall just plot out the form itself. So, one, two, three, four, five. And then basically, so we'll have the five block plot. So it'll look like we have the water in there. And if we go to the nine block block thing, so it's like one, that, three, like this, one, two, okay, so I guess we just have to look at the circle plot then, go on the nine block, so let's see, let's get some dirt, just like this, and that, basically it just goes like this. So we got that. Now um, let's make some more planks. There we go. Geez, that's really painful to look at. But, oh well. Okay, so now I just need to get the, um, get the door down. Uh, I'm not sure how I'll light this yet, but I'll figure that out later. Maybe what I'll do is I'll just put like a block right here and then just have some torches on it or something. Actually, let's do it right now, so let's see if we do like... like a support strut for the next floor as well. There we go. And then we can just go like torch, 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 a torch there, torch there, torch there, and a torch there. We can have a torch here and here, torch here and here, torch here and here, and finally a torch here and here. There we go, that should be good. If we even have to, we could even put like fences around or something. Let's go get a hoe and also some potatoes so that we can plant it. I guess I'll put, make this floor potatoes. I mean, why not? Um, let's see, so. Don't need. Okay, so we got some stone for stone bricks. Since that's all cooked, um. Yeah, let's just get some so sticks. I got sticks. So one, two. Um, that should be good for now. More. Yep, I have a couple more in here. Let's take some as well. Um, let's see, I'll have to grab some water from over here. Oh wait, that's right, I don't really have much. Okay, let's go grab some potatoes. Mm -hmm. And of course later on I'll have to put some pumpkins out. Oh wait, that's right, I could just place a jack lantern down. I don't even have to have the wood decorated with wooden beams, but you know what? It makes it look nicer because then you can see, like, okay, this thing actually is supported instead of it. Okay, this thing's just, like, magically floating. I don't think that would work though in real life. Farm goods, I guess pumpkins going there. Let's go to stack of potatoes for now. Let's go back to the farm. I'll till that ground, I'll build them the next floor. Now how do I want to get the next floor? Maybe a staircase would be good? Maybe I could have like a staircase going up from here, I guess. Yeah, it seems like it would be good.